Kanye, welcome back from the commercial break. We'd like to talk to you about the new study we have on video games in society. Our, our guest today is Dr. Danielson. Great to be on the show. Hello, doctor. Hello, Mr. L.A. So, we have, we heard you, you wrote a new book on... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Got a wonderful Would you like to tell us about this? Oh, yeah, it's a wonderful new book. It's about the, um, about the effect on video games on our youth, and uh, especially violent video games. And uh, we found some uh, very shocking things that video games can promote an antisocial environment, and uh, they can also promote violence in real life. Do you have any examples of these? Well, actually, yes. There's a one kind boy I met back in uh, back in the years, and I still talk with today. He's my uh, my grandchild. His name is Austin, and uh, he's, uh, he's a great, great boy. You know, he's a very kind boy. But uh, when he plays these video games. He becomes actually violent in real life, and he becomes angered, as uh, we can uh, Just from kind video games? Oh yeah, just from video games, we can see right here. Hey, Susa. Susa. Susa! I died because of you! Now, as you can see, that boy is obviously angered. What causes all that anger? You know, it's essentially just the violence in these games. The uh, they've got war concepts, and they've got all these all these hatred things. You know, they go around. They uh, essentially the point of this game that he was playing was simply just to kill people. But don't they understand that's just a game? Why do they get so frustrated? That's the thing. Uh, in the early stages of playing these games, or the early stages of a video gamer. They believe the game is simply just a game, and that's obviously an excuse, excuse, but soon they start playing these games hours and hours on end, 32 hours on end, and they just keep playing these games, and soon it becomes their life. And I've heard it, they don't eat, they don't sleep, they can just play for hours on end with no nutrition, no sleep. No, they, uh, they, they play hours on end, just like you said. They don't eat, they don't sleep. It's horrible for their health, just awful for their health. These kids are needing help. Aren't their parents regulating this at all? You know what? That's the common problem in the household. Parents need to step in. They need more action. They need to start regulating what these children play, because if they don't, they're seriously going to be harming their children. So thank you very much for all the helpful information you gave us. That really helped the families at home with gamers. Oh, no oh, problem. Welcome back anytime. Oh, thank you, Mr. Lyon. Anything I can do for you. Also, we have Snooky next up.